I come to you today uh, as we uh, uh, approach World AIDS Day to uh, honor the memory of those that uh, uh, succumbed to the disease uh, uh, over the last four decades. Today, HIV AIDS is not what it used to be, in grand part uh, thanks to some of the research that we have contributed to uh, through our center. In particular, uh, the discovery of highly active antiretroviral therapy, or HEART, in 1996, and subsequently, uh, the discovery of the ability of uh, the HEART treatment to actually stop HIV transmission among people on treatment. That led us to postulate in 2006 that if we were to treat everybody infected with HIV in a particular jurisdiction uh, and support them adequately, uh, then those individuals would not progress to AIDS, they would not die prematurely from AIDS, and in addition to that, uh, they would be, become non-infectious, and in doing so, we would uh, basically be able to stop the epidemic. Working with the United Nations AIDS program, uh, we uh, developed, based on the notion of treatment prevention, uh, two separate uh, uh, targets for the role of antiretroviral therapy global. The targets are the so-called 90-90-90 by 2020 and 95-95-95 by 2025. Uh, basically what they do is they uh, uh, call for a given number of persons, in this case 90% of those dealing with HIV to be diagnosed, at least 90% of those to be on treatment, and at least 90% of them to be biologically suppressed by the year 2020, following which uh, we move the target to 95, 95, 95. So this can be done. The question is, are we going to do it nationally? The rest of the country has not seen the impact of antiretroviral therapy on HIV transmission. We need the political leadership and the investments that are necessary uh, to ensure that the large provinces in particular in this country uh, fully implement treatment and prevention, meet the target so that we can bring the epidemic under control. Canada could lead the way in actually ending this epidemic uh, by the year 2030. We need the political will and I count on you to help me uh, to mobilize that will. Thank you very much.